Morning, everybody. It was a great start to the morning with sheep loose on the road. This morning we are off to our third sheep sale in four days. It's a bit hectic. This time of year we're buying a lot of sheep in. Yesterday we went ram shopping at the Dolphin Fair, which is a sheep fair just down the road. It looked a bit like this. A bit of four, 20 for 20 for 20 for 40 for 40. 460, 460, 460 for out ringside, way in the back. At 460 selling at 460 selling at 460 sold at 460. And we bought these guys. Go on then. No fisty cats. Nice boys. Just going straight after the ram lambs. Absolute predators. Look at them. Oh yes. They average just under £400, they were £375. Today's Ashford sale, there's around 7,000 store lambs. A store lamb is a lamb that isn't fit enough to kill yet, so it needs to go on and grow somewhere. So we have these markets. Everyone in the local area brings all their sheep to the market. People come from all over the country, buy the lambs, take them back to their area, their farm, whatever, grow them on, get them fit, then they go into the food chain from there. So that is a store lamb. And today there's 7,000 booked in, which isn't a huge sale, but it's a pretty, pretty decent sized sale. So I'm gonna to go to that and I'm gonna try and film little bits and just show you what happens really. And if we can, we're gonna try and buy some ewes. They might be a little bit too expensive, but I don't know what's there, but we're gonna try and pick up a few breeding ewes. So I'm gonna try and take you with me. You're welcome. The sheep are transported to the market in lorries and trailers. They're then unloaded onto these docks. The sellers, along with market staff, then arrange them into their allotted pen numbers. It can be a pretty busy day. Then the sheep just chill in their pens until they're ready to go into the ring to be sold. Or until someone walks past them with a GoPro and disturbs them. It's also in these pens before the sale where you're able to check the stock that you want to buy. I'm checking for teeth and bags on these breeding ewes that I'm hoping to be able to buy. The sheep then run up here and then through there into the ring to be sold. Today in the ring we observed a two minute silence to remember Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. She was the longest serving monarch in history and reigned for at least 70 years to mourn the passing of Her Majesty Queen II and reflect on her life and legacy. Eight, 
After the lambs have all sold, I managed to buy these three to five lamb clins for eighty-five pounds. And these flock aged Texel crosses for ninety pounds. So that is the used home. I'm pretty happy with what we bought. Gonna get a minute go for them all tomorrow. Can you believe this is the same farm I showed you last week? Unbelievable what a bit of rain does. Markets are a really, really important part of farming. We don't get out very much. We don't get to see that many people. So they're quite a social event to go to as well. It's also for me, I found markets to be a real wealth of knowledge. Where I've, where we've started farming on our own, um, we haven't got that bank of knowledge to go to. I haven't got my dad about or my granddad about to go and ask their experience or get their point of view on things or just that knowledge is really missing. So there's a few people there that are a bit older than me that I can ask a few things and they'll teach me. Um, so I find the markets really, really important to go to. So I do like going to them. Also, you can buy stuff. Who don't like going shopping? sheep shopping if you did enjoy this video don't forget to like and subscribe because it all helps until next time